somebody roll a d6 for me? Ooh. Four. Four it is. Okay. So you guys trek on through the dead ashen forest. As you go further and further along, you notice it is getting decidedly colder as you move along. And Ooh. suddenly a heavy snowstorm begins to blow. It patters against your face, whipping up icicles through your hair and nostrils. You feel a cold you've never felt before. It, it, it seems to reach to the very bottom of your bones. And you notice that your skin is starting to turn incredibly pale. Everybody give me a reflex save. Uh, 19. Oops. Um, 11. 11? 11. Okay. Oh, yeah. 28. 28. All right. You two, shake off the cold, dust it off of you. Uh, you notice as you wipe the flakes off of yourself in, in haste, you realize that they were actually like tiny hands trying to grip onto your ligaments, your skin, oh, get into your bones. You're trying to get them off. You're like, ah! Like you do not react in time. And due to your full metal plate armor, it actually is quite colder than you'd like, even with the warm wrappings. Nick, you lose four points of dexterity. Okay. Oh, it's wow. ability drain. I have endurance. Or excuse me, damage, not drain. It's not damaged. permanent. <laughs> You have endurance? I do have endurance. Yeah, Before doesn't, doesn't, I didn't think that was Because I haven't cast it yet. I'm going to do an extend mage armor. Okay. Sure. So you guys press on uh, until eventually it gets very, very close to nighttime. And uh, you come across this village. It appears to be abandoned. There's wooden huts that you can tell are built on slats to keep above the snow. And uh, it's, it's kind of wide. It's got about a 50-foot radius. There's huts and houses around. That's, that's about it. The snow is still falling heavily. Shall we, uh, take a break in my cloud dimension? What? <laughs> I mean, as... as an earth cleric. As a cleric of... Earth. Moradin. <clears throat> I can create some earth in there. I'll be kind. You'd like you, something solid to the stand other thing on. But other than that, that, that sounds good. <clears throat> the other thing is that you will want to have... If, if we could rest longer, <clears throat> our colleague can recover his health. Sure. That'd be great. You can rest for about 18 hours. <laughs> then the That's next day you can cost time. it again and you can rest another 18 yeah, hours. I can exactly. Yeah, I cure myself and then set it. Sounds like we're taking a nice break. We're, we're going to take a two night, one day <laughs> break. I, I a cast. Rope trick break? I, I do extend on rope trick. And you just, just climb up there? Shoot me up there? Yeah. All right. You guys, now you can't see anything that's going on outside. Uh, no, you can. Trick. Yeah, you, you can. can. Yeah. yeah. Oh, really? You look out yeah. the hole. Oh, okay. I, we can well, look out. But if you guys are asleep. Yeah, if we're sleeping. Yeah. Yeah. Y yeah. yeah. It's just a rope hanging in air, right? No, no. no if you no, pull the rope up, so you can look out look the space invisible. with you. All right. Yeah. yeah. It's basically a system for the game to allow adventurers to rest in dangerous places without being in danger so yeah. that they can recover from yeah. things like this. Yeah. I mean, we might, we might as well go on watch to just take a look at the outside. Yeah. I mean, we're, we're going to be there for like two days. Yeah. All right. You just hang out in the village? All right, who goes on watch outside the rope trick first? Why would we be outside? You don't. We, oh, we just look out, out the hole. Right. Yeah. So you peek out the hole. All right. Uh, who does it? We would take, we would take rounds. I mean, oh, well, actually, first... maybe we should take rounds, because he yeah, needs just... full bed rest, too. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 I mean, yeah, right. I'll, 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 cast, I'll create a uh, better earth wounds, on him. And then... Cure that wounds won't do no, anything. No, no, you need restoration. Yeah. Which he should have. I mean, I do have. Yeah, so you'll, yeah, then you'll cast, then we'll just need one night. And yeah, I'll cast restoration. Yeah, I'll okay. Re so, it. yeah, you can just cast that, and we just have shifts of three. <clears throat> yeah, so it's just roll d6. One, All right. two, three, four, five, six. Sounds good. All right, Nick's on first watch, then. Yeah, you yeah. Okay. Give me a spot, Nick. A spot check? That's a 20. You scan the trees looking for any sign of movement, but you see nothing. However... Within the village itself, and from the other side of the of the forest, you see strange, ghostly blue forms moving about the trees. As the night goes on and your watch continues, they slowly move closer and closer to the village. And as they move into view, you can see and make out their faces. They are faces of men and women, villagers, different kinds of races, and they appear to mingle about in the village doing their different tasks and various things. They go to mills and grind for bread. They chop ghostly axes against the trees, which does nothing, of course. Are, are these like rundowns, or are these like like dilapidated buildings that they're going into? In the yeah, morning, these yeah, it's an old village. So, and they're just kind of wandering okay, about, cool. ghostly wise and stuff like that. 
Do you just go back to sleep or? Well, I mean, well, I'll, I mean, I'll wake he's up. on watch, so. Do you rouse them? Or? I'll, I'll, I mean, you guys don't have things to prep. Well, I mean, I have spells. You've already so gone I, need, I need eight hours of rest, to, you know. But you didn't use any, don't they still? I used rope don't trick still? and mage armor. Okay, use All right, I'll wake you up. Sure. <laughs> I'll have a look and I'll go. <laughs> they seem like just the shades of spirits who <clears throat> were killed quickly, but not horribly. You notice they're still going about their day to day business, which suggests that they were tortured or killed in a horrific way. It's almost like they were turned into philosopher's stones or something, but nothing beyond that. Like a natural disaster. Yes. <laughs> All right. Otherwise, All right. they would show the signs of like evil intent, or they would be distended or like horrifically charged or something. But they're not attacking; they're just going about their daily routine. So these are simply so they, the shades. So they, they also feel don't... any sort of like emotional. Yeah, they didn't die in a violent trauma. fashion. They simply died quickly and almost without even realizing they had been killed. Like so some sort of like, like <clears throat> huge area instant. effect. Yeah, just yeah. Cataclysmic. <clears throat> yeah. All right, Pompeii or like yeah, a nuclear yeah. bomb or something. I'm thinking Pompeii. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, next watch. I'm guessing it's you. Of course. Yes. Uh, Give me a spot check. Four, Ooh, it was spotty spot. Swear it's gonna be one of those just looking straight at you. Uh, 25. That awesome. A howl shrieks through the forest trees around you as you peek outside your pocket dimension. A snarl, a flash of light, a burst of nice. cinders through the trees, and a whole pack of ash cloud wolves come streaming through the town, yipping, banging, howling, ripping, tearing at the ghosts. They pay them no mind. Their ethereal forms. The, go the ash cloud wolves streak through it. You can see their eyes lighting up with fire, and they zip off into the rest of the trees. They ignore you, of course. Do we have that skill that all great adventurers and discoverers during the 16th, 17th, and 1800s had where despite they can sketch, what, they can sketch anything perfectly? perfectly. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, sure, why not? Okay, of because course. I don't want to wake my colleague, but I want to make sure he has a sure. thorough sketch yeah. to look at. All right. Right. Certainly. Do, do they look more like, what is it, like Blistering Firecat or like the fire dogs from Venture Time? Yes. Because that's what I'm picturing, <laughs> one of those. <laughs> oh, yeah. They're a comedy. See, they're probably more like blistering fire. See, I just, probably. I, I, they're I, more I, elemental. I yes. imagine like a moving kind of cloud and every once in a while like fire and like solid form would appear. Do you and guys be a see? Wolf. You remember Lord of the Rings where Gandalf enchants that water so it turns to be horses? Yeah. Yes. Like, so okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like, if I have time, I'll make the drawings smaller and make a stack of them so I can like, <laughs> so you can see it look like they're moving. There you go. Well, that, that would take a long time. time. <laughs> Just make a flip book the entire night. I'm, I'm the kind of halfling that wants my friends to have the full experience. I don't do anything halfway. There you go. <laughs> oh, super grilling. <laughs> All right. Okay. So you guys rise. I'm assuming you rest up at the village for two days then? How long do Wait, you rest? How, is how is, what, can, can I get a point of clarification here? I yeah. thought we were in a clearing when this happened. No, 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 you moved from the clearing <clears throat> towards the village. So the clearing oh, okay. was where you decided to go to the other pathway. Yeah. Oh, this is another village beyond. Yeah, I didn't, after a I didn't understand how we ended up thought, at another yeah, village. I thought the oh, village okay. was talking about where you met the elf. Oh, no, 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 no that no, was okay. last time. That's far oh, back okay. at the yeah, start. Yeah, yeah. You right. guys are already somewhat into the outlands at this point. Okay, right? yeah, that's why I was confused, because I'm going, where is this village suddenly showing up here? I thought we were in a clearing. All right. Oh, wait, do you take last watch that night? Okay. Give me a spot check. All right, for myself, I get... Uh, pretty low, a 10, and for the bat, that is a 20. Nothing eventful except for the groan and creaking of the trees shifting their positions, lifting their roots out of the ground and moving to cover up the pathways you've seen previously and opening up a new one. I'll study it and write it down. All right. Do they, they like, like say anything? Do they... I don't know, it's up to them. I don't know, it's very interesting. We how just hear they, freaking, how, right? how would yeah. a wizard enchant a tree to be animated only once in a 24-hour period, but have it happen every night? Very interesting. These are creaks each other. Maybe quite they're spell. always animated. Is it they the require quality a lot of that, is, that happened I bet it's when not the trees were grown? So how long are you guys staying in the village with your rope tricks abilities and everything? Uh, just I mean, we, just, we just need one day because you need to cast the spell. Yeah. Okay. So, so you only stay for one night. Yeah. One, one whole, yeah. One yeah, whole I mean, day cycle. Right. Mm -hmm. I'm so not willing to hang out where all these ghosts and fire dogs are running. But we make sure it is daylight when we yeah. come out to travel. So the second night passes Absolutely. just about the same way. Um, you see the ghosts wander in town again as well. Wait, wait, why are we staying a second night? Because well, it was already almost nighttime, it was nighttime when we got there. there originally. So we don't want to leave 24 hours later and then travel through the night. So we stay God. one more night so to make sure we go in there. Right. So okay. the second night, the ghosts do the exact same routine <coughs> as the previous night. And you get the mm -hmm. sense that they probably do this every night. 
Um, you guys stay in rope trick the entire time. Mm-hmm. Okay. No wolves come through this time, uh, and the trees do not move. Interesting. All right. I'm glad we have this rope trick. There you go. It's quite the trick. It is now the morning of the <laughs> third day of your expedition. <laughs> Okay. All right. So, uh, mark down rations. Uh, I don't eat. Yeah, that's right. Anybody who eats. Whoa. Yeah, I probably eat. But uh, are you I... carrying rations for us? Oh yeah, I got rations. Right. Everyone was given twenty rations. Yeah. Why no, don't, twenty why total don't you eat? among all of you. What? Yeah, twenty oh, rations total. What? Yeah. Oh, oh, you had that many. Oh, that's oh, way. Sorry. I thought I, I thought it was clear. <laughs> that's that we each had twenty incredibly rations. So we Thank goodness we have a cleric who can make food now. In that case. He casts his... No, we're not eating our rations. You're, you're casting that spell that gives yeah. us food. I'm going to do that. Yeah, because we're not going to use up rations until we have to. Yeah. He doesn't expect to be alive in 20 days anyway. <laughs> yeah. I, I mean, I didn't. I just give all the rations. Or, or what? Like, like yeah. So days. we're not eating our rations, because as long as that we have Declare us. casting the food spell, we're going to use that while he's good to go. Okay. Also, we'll never know if we see like people yeah, that we need to give rations to in order to buy their favor. Yeah, sure. What if we find the previous party? Yeah. It's like, oh... There's one survivor to tell us the horrible story of how they were all killed. Yeah. We need to okay, give him a couple yeah, I'll, I'll, I guess I have to use a spell to make this face. All right. And then the morning of the third day, we'll just assume that you cast that the day and then you prepped it the next morning. Yeah. yeah. And so, in the morning, oh, yes. armor extend. Yeah. Okay. Um, the morning of the third day, you awake to find that two pathways lie open to you, one mm-hmm. to the northeast and one to the direct east. I'm going to use Compass Rose Directions, because it'll be easier. Uh, Mr. Burroughs, I believe your eyes... They did needed. say that the obelisk is to the north. We should stay on focus and not get distracted. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. If we get lost, I have no direction to the <clears throat> north. There we go. But both pathways are about in the north-ish direction, Yeah, right? I mean, yeah. It's, at this point, it seems like we... Oh, no. One goes east, and one goes northeast. So if we're going go north- northeast... We probably go northeast. Northeast? Or, I mean, that just it's makes... a trick. The trees, maybe they know. If only we could speak to with plants. I mean, sure, it could be a trick. I know. <laughs> We're all looking at the druid. If only Where he had t- taken his sick. lithium pills before getting on that boat. <laughs> oh my gosh. Seasickness. It'll if get the best of If only he hadn't decided to take that vacation. So weak. <laughs> Can't be trusted. So which pathway? Northeast, my Northeast. Friends. All right. <clears throat> you guys head off northeast, journeying for about a day. Give me a d6 roll, somebody. Oh. Nick, you're up. Three. Three it is. All right. A heavy snowfall rains down upon you. It trod, You have to trod through things to keep going. Do it's, we recognize it as the evil heavy snowfall that we have to hide from? No. <laughs> it's not the same thing. It's not a snowstorm as the previous right. one was. Because it's it is. We give our cleric immediate yeah. warning. It's like, it's that snow again! Hide! <laughs> it would be slow going for you guys, yeah, but have you, you have Endure Elements, correct? I do have Endure. Okay. And six ranks in survival? Mm-hmm. Give me a survival check. Oh, all right. That is a d6. Not with a d6. Gosh. There you go. Got this. <laughs> so that's eight plus six plus three is seventeen. Seventeen it is. You oh, know sufficient. Oh. He has nine ranks in. Oh, in survival. Yeah, he's because oh. you're saying ranks. Yeah. That means he has six oh, plus yeah, yeah. three. Oh, oh yeah, nine ranks is what. Yeah. I mean. Did I say yeah. ranks or? You've been you've been saying ranks. Okay. Yeah, that's yeah. right. What's I your... want I want ranks. Oh, oh! What's your skill I'm bonus? I'm sorry, the skill, yeah. bo- the skill bonus. Yeah, yeah. Yes, but it still doesn't matter. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I was. I, und- it right. I understood. Okay. <laughs> you were doing it right. What? It wouldn't. It wouldn't have changed anything. So it's yeah, all right. no, no. I just want to clarify. That's good. It's all right. By the rules, we're still okay. Mm-hmm. Um, okay. So, uh, heavy snow falls, and it would slow you guys down. But because of his survival skills, he knows how to travel in heavy snow, and he makes you guys' trip as fast as it would be without it. Yes. You ignore it. All right. So you move along, and eventually um, you come to a kind of a crossroads. The path you've come from, of course, one that heads to the northwest, one that heads to the southeast, and one that goes more towards the northeast, traveling along the same route you were traveling. However, more interesting is the man who has a noose around his neck and is about to jump off a tree branch. Uh, uh, is this like, uh, right in front uh, of us? Uh, Sir, uh, no! Uh, Goodman, uh, stop! Uh, don't try and stop me! A large person! What? I cast a large person. No, don't choke! No, no, no. Breaks three. You sure? He makes a strength check, he does. Are you sure? I thought it was like if they couldn't... Let me I, wanna, I would rather hold check. person. Let me check. Yeah. Do we have that? I have it. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Oh, I know. Uh, do I have a scroll of it? No, I don't have a scroll of animate. Oh, I do have a scroll of animate rope. What are you doing? What? what uh, do you want to do something? Large person thing, I kinda and wanna, then I'll oh, double check. check. Large. How far up is he? Can I Can <laughs> I large if he to cut do. the rope? He's on a high branch. He's about 12 feet off the ground. He has to get sufficient room so it'll snap his neck and it'll mm. 
I run over there in preparation to. Oh wait, I guess the rope could be so high that I can't reach it because I'm just a little guy. Yeah, Trust I, I okay. would use the classic halfling ability to convince people that they want to live because we're such spirited folk. Yeah, you gotta roll something. Work. This is a torchbearer. <laughs> you, you, you give him the it gets better speech. I, yes. <laughs> yeah, right? It's, it's okay, All man. Right. <laughs> I, I, I don't know. Like, I can just point at it and animate the rope, right? Sure. What does it say? I can command it to uncoil. All right. So... I'm gonna, just to un- I'm gonna pull out of the How- Howard's hand- ha- handy haversack. Okay. And then animate the rope. Wait, no, that's not gonna. That's gonna Wait, dude, that's a good. It's not gonna take long enough. Yeah. Because then I have to command it the next round, or to be dead. Yeah. I thought you were gonna animate his rope. Do you have to touch it, or is it to have? No, no, no. I, 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 can, I think I can just point. It should say on the spell. It should say a range of casting. It yeah, say range, range. hundred feet. Plus yeah. 10. So you so can. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I can cast grease and make him slip through it. I don't think that would work. No, Can't you just animate work. the rope and yeah, have let me just, just hold person? Um, you guys got ten seconds to decide. Come on, Peter. Uh, just cast hold person. Hold person. All right. Yeah. He makes a will save. Peter, what's the DC for the will save? Or oh, Nick? Nick's doing it. Yeah. So it's DC fifteen. Okay. Here we go. What? <laughs> yeah, that's cocked. Okay. So he goes. And he freezes in place, unable to move. Excellent. So we have All right. plenty of time. Climb, climb up there and undo the rope. We're going to find out what this guy knows. Yes. Also save his life. <laughs> climb check it is. Oh, I mean, we have... How many I rounds? have climbing gear. How, how, how long does it I last? Can, uh... Whole person? Hmm? I it should last, last one round, round per level. Yeah, one round. So you got nine rounds. So nine you rounds? Have, uh, you know, uh-huh. Okay. Whole so we can take ten on the climb. Seconds. Yeah. 54 seconds. We can take ten That's then. Quite a while. You think so? Right. It's only if it's nine rounds. I guess. Well, but based on the climbing rules, like yeah, it's yeah, nine it's rounds. I mean, unless you, he's like you, you, 120 you can feet in the air. Only not take ten when you're, you're in danger. danger. All right, you're not in danger, sense. and you can move at half. Yeah, speed. I mean, like, like so I can just be like take time. the climbing gear out of my backpack and just use it. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So you guys take ten to ascend the tree. Who ascends the tree? You uh, have the strength to carry. I have to hold him. You don't. Well, it's, don't I? You don't have to concentrate. A hold person doesn't have concentrate, so you just. Well, then I'll climb. You'll climb and I'll catch. Okay. So yeah. you you shimmy up there, yeah. and what do you do? He's got the noose like this around his neck. Well, I'm gonna take the You have a knife, off. right? What? You have a knife, right? You can just cut the rope. I assume I do. Who knows? You, you, might you either have a knife or you don't. <laughs> sure, I have a knife. I do cut you have the a, rope. Okay, you cut the rope. Yeah. All right, you cut the rope free uh, from him. Take it out of his hands. Mm-hmm. It's not really down All right, now what do you do? He's still holding up, perched on the tree branch. Just carry him down. <laughs> yeah, just grab him. Yeah, I mean, yeah. like... You're already so anyway. Like, 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 you may as well just... Like, come and hand him. <laughs> All right, so you carry him down. I can't want to climb Set him on the ground, him. and the spell wears off. Sure. Oh, Wham! What did you... Oh, no, why did you stop me? Why did you stop me? I have to get out of here. It was my only escape. We can help you get out of You're here. You're going to transform into something terribly monstrous, aren't you? No. Why would you think that? I've seen so many things transform into monstrous things out here. I don't, What's I don't gonna want to happen? do it anymore. What's going to happen if you're alive? You're going to have a wonderful life. That's what. <laughs> what? Where did you come from? How, how are you just alone here in the woods? From the castle. They, we didn't make it out. I climbed, I climbed over the We're, wall. Almost you, died. Wait, are you an adventurer? Do you have class levels? I was a hireling. A hireling for one of the other adventurers. Uh, the summer party? I was carrying their things, but... I can't go back there. I have to get out of this forest. You you made it this far and you were about to kill yourself? I mean, it's just a day's journey to the, to like the shore. You, like you made it out of the... that close? Yes. The this is what happens when you give up too soon. I've been wandering about in this forest for two weeks. I'm only lucky I had enough food to survive the trip. You're a day and a half away from the water. Oh my. Quitters well, never win and winners never least, quit. Uh, we assume that we're a day and a half away from the water. Shh. I can't... We're saving a life here. I can't believe... You were so close. close. Right now you are about to drop a little water. You must expand. Let yourself rise like the majestic cloud. Trust in the journey. It is the journey that matters. All right. Not the outcome. Th- or you come with us. We're, we're going to succeed. No. No, I'm not going back there. Mm-hmm. Not for all the money in the world. Okay. We can't let, yeah. you, we can't let you leave this fo- in this forest alone. That would be unjust. Then take me back to the shore. I see no problem with this. We could try that. We have a boat. You could... Yeah. I mean, we can well, take him back to that fighter. What's his name? Zafael. Do, do we really want to go back? It's a day and a half I, back I up. I don't want to go back. The trees do shift. 
Mm. Like, we could very easily get lost on the way back. I'm certain I can make it by myself. I made it this far, apparently. Yes, I must see? be better at it than I think. You are much better at this than Doing you think. Great. If you keep up, one day you will develop road levels if you keep up at this. Here. He reaches into his cloak out of a patch. I took this from, from the library. Library? I, oh, I can't believe I got oh, out of Thank goodness he life. didn't throw it into the fire. That would have been like brilliant. It was partially burned when I got it. Please, be careful. We're done well acquiring this. Please, be careful. And he flees off into the forest. Good for you. I say, wait! <laughs> I, I don't All move right. to stop. Is this uh, Homota? Aquinox? Hellfire Mountain. Main gate. And this strange writing. It's like it's like cuneiform of some kind. Yeah, it is cuneiform. I don't think I can read yeah, it. Is it, is it, is it Akkadian, it's too Sumerian? Bad. You'll have to wait to figure out the puzzle like they are. Akkadian, Sumerian, cuneiform. <clears throat> yeah. Well, both of these are the same. You guys have reached a crossroads. Don't? Oh. I, have, I think I have some. Oh, I have decipher script. Oh, yes. Which script would you like to decipher? I'm going to try to do it all of it. <coughs> the whole thing? All right. all right, well, first, I'll do this cuneiform. Right. Okay, so well, you, least, you've least passed least the success. Now, now can I see the... Oh, yeah. Hold it up so I can see it. Okay, good. Got some interesting markings. What looks like a map, although the lines don't quite match up to, to make... To he didn't sense. have adventuring levels, so he doesn't have perfect artistic rendition like all other... No, he took this are. from a library. And burn marks. Oh, okay. And burn so marks. This is something from yeah. Aquinox. Can I, uh, Probably from the yeah, Ash. Ash Clearly, they were right. done by the Modrons of concordant opposition, since they so use all right angles. You angle. have no idea what the hell those symbols are. Okay. You don't know. It's uh, not a language you've ever heard of. It's not something you can even seem to discern. Got it. Um, this, however, is an ancient language, which you know of. It's an ancient uh, form of writing. And basically, oh, he's off that fire to it again. Oh, sorry. There's even, like, burn. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, those, those from before. Oh, okay. Yeah, those those two right. symbols no. in conjunction with each other. Separately, they mean they mean um, uh, run and or they mean water and walk. Put together, it means flee as the river runs from this place or flee very quickly. Mm. It has run kind of a dual meaning. From hmm. here it could mean and it could mean follow the waterways to escape, or it could mean flee as fast as you possibly can. You need more context to be sure.